Here's a quick video of my sealer. It's probably a generic Chinese made one. Typical temperature goes up to eight. For non you know, plastic that's not meant for it, all you really need is the two or the three. Sixteen inches long, but they make them 12, eight, whatever. So here's a book I'm gonna ship. This is just a regular magazine backer. I don't really use them for hardcover books, but just wanna show you how it works. I'll put that in there. All right. So I put it in the magazine backer. Put it on like two. Just put it on there like that. And then press down. That's what it looks like. I'll cut that. Okay. So this is now the book. Sealed. So this is just normal reused uh, bubble wrap that I put in a little roll just so it'd be easier. This is really all I would use normally. The magazine cover I just did to show how it works. cut that all right so I cut that now close it with a bit of tape now all I'm gonna do is seal the edges with the heat sealer let me do that real quick so this is one side where I just sealed it and opened it and I can cut it. And then this is an example where I seal it and pull it out at the same time and it creates its own edge. This is typically the way I do it. So now this is the completed sealed book in bubble wrap. And normally I, would, I wouldn't go to this extreme, but for this book, I'm gonna mail out in an old milk bag. So I'm gonna basically turn this inside out. And then seal this in this, and then put a ship mailing label right on it. I'll do that now. All right, so I turned the bag inside out. All I'm gonna do is put this in here and seal it. All right, so basically seal that. This is what I'm left with. Now, normally I wouldn't use a milk bag. I would use that for the trash because I got plenty of other bags. And I prefer, but I will really use like, uh, red bags or blue bags from bookstores and that's it
plastic that's on here just basically peels off or crumbles off. And this is it, the final product, all using the sealer. I'm mailing it like this. It's asking for trouble. But I don't care.